These are my top seven tips to secure your home network. And I'll throw in a few bonus tips at the end of this video to help dial in your network security. And guys and gals, if you enjoyed this content, make sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Thanks. First network security tip, you need to update all of your operating systems on all your devices. This is one of the most important steps that's overlooked because these updates often include the latest security patches that can help block the newest security threats. So take the extra five minutes to download the latest version of Windows 11 or Mac OS and grab a cup of coffee and install and download it. Easy. Bam. Second home security tip, you need to update your router's firmware and your web browsers. So first log into your router's IP address and look for firmware updates. Then go ahead and check for any updates and then install them. And just a heads up, you can make this process automatic by checking the auto update box. Next, go ahead and update the browser that you're using. For instance, if you use Google Chrome, go to settings and look for update. And once again, these browser updates contain security patches for the latest security threats. And one more thing, once you're done browsing the internet, close the browser. Never leave your browser open for days on end it's a huge security risk. Okay, home network security tip number three. Enable all your firewalls, antivirus software, anti-malware software, VPNs, and custom DNS for all your devices. And that includes cell phones, laptops, tablets, and PCs. So that means all of your network devices and end devices like routers and PCs, should have the firewalls turned on. And most operating systems include a basic antivirus software, so make sure to run a virus scan at least once a month. Twice will be better. And you can also download some third-party software, like Malwarebytes, for extra online protection. And use a VPN if you want your connection to be encrypted and secure. Also consider using custom DNS settings like Cloudflare to block malware and adult websites. And just a heads up, we're not sponsored by Cloudflare, we just like their product. And lastly, using a Pi-hole DNS server is fantastic for blocking ads and unsecure websites. All right guys and gals, the fourth home networking security tip, Secure your wireless network with a separate guest network. This is one of the best ways to keep your local network secure. Your guest network will provide an internet connection for your guests, but restricts access to the local network, which is very important. Because if your guests are logged into your local wireless network, and for some reason they have an infected device like a laptop, well that laptop will affect your local network. And the guest network will keep this from happening so use it. All right guys, the fifth home network security tip, always use the admin account on your PC when making any changes to your network, like router settings. And then once you're done, log out of the admin and then log back into your basic user account. Always use the basic user account for web surfing, gaming, or checking emails. By doing this, this helps prevent hackers from making changes to your network settings since you're logged in as a user and not an admin. If you're logged in as an admin, and an attacker gains access, then your network will be compromised. And just a heads up, some attackers can gain access by leveling up from user to admin, but not all attackers have that ability. So keep this in mind. All right, guys and gals, our sixth home network security tip, change all network passwords every three months. This includes router admin passwords, Wi-Fi passwords, and even guest Wi-Fi passwords. If you have managed switches and pile servers, change those passwords too. And speaking of passwords, you want to choose long and complicated passwords. The longer, the better. Because the longer the password, the longer it takes to be hacked. I would say a minimum of 14 characters. All right, guys and gals, our seventh home network security tip, reboot all your network devices every two months. That means unplug all your network devices, like your modem, router, switches, and access points for about 60 seconds. Then plug them all back in. And just a heads up, it'll take about two to three minutes for your network to fully come back on. So be patient. These reboots or power cycles will trigger security updates and will even clear the memory in these devices. And good news, many viruses and malware cannot live through a power cycle, but unfortunately, some can. And while you're on vacation, unplug any network devices you won't need while you're away. And just a heads up, a reboot of all your network devices is a fantastic way to resolve any network issues, like slow connections or unstable connections. So all in all, a reboot is good for multiple things. All right guys, you made it this far, so here's a couple more tips to dial in your home network security. Tip number one, hide your SSID. So go into your router settings and look for broadcast SSID and you wanna turn that off. This will hide your SSID, which makes your network invisible. Next thing you wanna do is disable universal plug and play. And you also wanna disable WPS. And lastly, look in your router settings for remote access and disable it. And guys and gals, that's it. That's my seven home networking security tips plus bonus tips. So when you implement all these tips, you'll have a secure home network. And with that, guys, make sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment. And for God's sake, smash the bell icon. And I'll see you in the next video real soon. High five. Peace.